So, okay. Um, man, okay. So, you know, I was speaking about um, Tay Savage, one of the proponents of, he, he, proponents of pushing peace and all that. He recently got booked. Um, this other guy's pushing peace, J Man, other guys. Uh, I see uh, Chief Keith. He's not really in the city, but he's from, he from the trenches. He's from Yahweh. Mm -hmm. I see him where, uh, while everybody doing that, he one of the biggest names in this shit, like one of the legends, legends, like over, mm -hmm. over the top legend, like, and uh, he, um, he, he, he uh, recently did a song where Sexy Red, where he was dissing Tuka. Now, mm -hmm. a, a lot of people, you know, most accounts that on Tuka, they say like he wasn't really in it like that or whatever, whatever. Right. So I was wondering like when he did that, like, um, what was your thoughts on that? What was it just like, he just rapping or like, did you have any thoughts on that or anything? Who? When Chief Keep this Tuka on the new Sexy Red song. Although, bro, you weren't really with that. I, I mean, bro, I really don't fault Fosun for doing nothing. He started that mm -hmm. shit. Like, you know, the, that he, is true. you know, like this shit, like, you know, you probably mad at him for doing it and then you probably feel like he, you know, people, people, uh, it's just like I know for like a lot of shit, you know, people be wanting people to move forward. Everybody has slip ups. He probably was in his bag and his glow. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like it'd be niggas who, you know, still target folks. When folks ain't thinking about nobody or coming for nobody, niggas still mention his name or do salty shady shit. Like it's mm -hmm. sometimes niggas gonna come for you, bro. Like that ain't no way to look at it. Oh, he like he started that shit, bro. Like he been saying this shit fifteen plus years. Well, twenty I mean 12, 13 years plus, like, yeah. you know, like. He did make that popular. Yeah, name. like, I was saying his name. Mm -hmm. Like, it, it like, he who started that that shit. Like, he was always the nigga saying dude's name, like, from the beginning. So, like, it, it you know, like, I get it, man. Motherfuckers gonna be mad. They don't want it mentioned. And they definitely don't want it mentioned on a song where niggas doing features with big artists. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like you doing that on a song that's promoting, that's gonna blow up and promote. You dissing folks. I get it. I understand both sides of it, but you know, so it's still the same nigga. You ain't That's... taking no kind of way though. It's like it is what it is. Like, yeah, bro. Saying. Like, like I don't really take when people still be like, I, it's a lot of people that do that, and I just, you know, I try to make, I just make sure I don't do it. Mm -hmm. I don't get mad at niggas for doing that mm -hmm. shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like certain shit you do, it's like it's it's, it's like I said with with other shit that you do as an adult. It's like certain shit cool to do as a kid. And certain shit cool to do. Uh, that's not cool to do as a kid. But one thing I can say about like still dissing, I see a lot of grown niggas still do it. Like that ain't really what niggas picked up. Like niggas kind of picked up. Like I feel like niggas over twenty five and twenty eight that's rapping, bro. They they know not to be putting guns. But if you got niggas twenty one and twenty three and younger, they they still doing it. Mm -hmm. So. You know, like he 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 still a young nigga. I know everybody like the Sosa probably about to be twenty nine. Mm -hmm. You feel me? In August, mm -hmm. and I'm finna be twenty eight. He probably finna be twenty nine mm -hmm. in August. So he's still a young nigga, bro. He do young nigga shit. You know what I'm saying? Like he he see mature to some degree because yeah, he about to, right, I'm gone. I'm moving around. Yeah, and like he knew he, he 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 you that know was, that was mature in him in my opinion. Yeah, he yeah. mature, he mature self, folks. But he yeah. know everybody slip up here and there. I guess he yeah. felt like he was on that. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but, but but did you know Tuka personally though? Not really. No, yeah. I ain't. I, I I mean, you know, you see niggas and shit. We for all this shit. But Tuka was Tuka was a good dude. Man. Mm -hmm. He won. He wasn't bad. You know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Part of that because he died young. He ain't really get a chance. Mm -hmm. so everybody don't be in this shit. It's early, early. You know what I'm saying. Some niggas are late bloomers or later bloomers. He was around. He was one of they official niggas and shit. But you know, he was short lived, mm -hmm. to say the least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. It, it's crazy too. I had interviews with shorties from O Block like back when I first started this shit and. Uh, they they talk like that regular. That's what they call weed. Like literally, like that's that's what they call weed. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, that's crazy. Like you know what I'm saying? I was in there like, damn. <laughs> that that's like off the camera. That's just how they talk. You know what I'm saying? They like, just they call them. Yeah. It's like that's crazy. Yeah, yeah for that's why that's why I just had that. Yeah. I, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Call weed. That is like that's crazy. yeah. It's like that's how it is growing up, man. Yeah. Like for them, man. Like that's. You know, like they do it, it over there. It could, it could have been like that too. Like that's just they lingo, not just yeah. really. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Like you know, like niggas, bro. 
They do it. The ops do it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like I know they call all type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, but you know, everything with us just seen a stick. We 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 don't we us, you know what I'm saying? So shit get bigger. Mm -hmm. But they do that shit, they call that shit all type of shit. All of my homies packed for like, you know what I'm saying? And that ain't like that's, that ain't me calling them that. That's them niggas calling them that. You know what I'm saying? Like for them then they they really call the niggas that. So yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah, that shit crazy though. But it is what it is. I mean, it's just crazy. But all right, so with, also another thing with Chief Keith, he uh, he had okay. He was he from the O. King Von from the O. King Von had like a little altercation with NBA Young Boy and them allegedly, you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. And um, then the shit with uh, my father, Mr. Shirty name, um, the shit with Lil Tim. Mm -hmm. Then the shit with Lil Tim, um. But Chief Keith, he had made a song with NBA Youngboy down the line, like probably like 2022, 2023 or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, when you when, when you seen that, did you feel like he was being rebellious or it was just like he just making music, he ain't got nothing to do with it? How did you view that when you seen that? When he made a song with Youngboy? Yeah, yeah, You ain't never heard that song? He made a song with Youngboy? Yeah, he got a song with Youngboy. No, I ain't never heard of that. Yeah, when yeah. that come out? Like 22 or 23, I was looking at it uh, over a couple was of days. Was this after Roy got killed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. After Vaughn after, after got, yeah, yeah. I feel like if it did come out, I feel like it probably got made before Roy died. Oh, okay. or before, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I don't know, for like, Sosa don't come out like, he not the, I'm your, I'm the friend of your enemy type mm -hmm. nigga. Like, just because they both, they don't fuck with y'all and I don't, mm -hmm. I got, I feel the way about y'all and they don't fuck with y'all, I'm going to go fuck with you you know like everybody was in the studio with young boy and finna make music with him before all this shit took place bro like mm -hmm. he was cool like it's, if you go you could research so many videos of these niggas talking and, and and them niggas communicating with each other for like and and rocking with us and being our fans mm -hmm. folk like these niggas was finna make mixtapes with each other before this shit happened bro like it was it was about to be that bro because they was the Hottest, hottest niggas shit, doing yeah. it like you you doing it where you from we doing it where we from it was only right that it would be that like it's 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 this shit common knowledge everybody was gonna be cool and was cool and, and in cahoots before this shit went down mm -hmm. so niggas was doing what they was doing i'm i can them that guarantee that's some shit that was done and made prior to and it probably ain't even dropped officially because i don't remember it probably was a leak yeah, it's like a little video they but they, they went in the video together um, um, yeah it um, probably um, i don't know that might be a leak or something yeah. ain't no telling but you know it should just be like you know i don't i don't, I don't think he was being rebellious it's probably some shit that happened before because like bro so ain't gonna i don't know bro. like even with the shit where i heard it was a diss or something like just that. Just recently, yeah, that's, yeah. What I was that's my follow up question because just recently a song came out where people took it like he was dissing and um, King Von brother, his name like Bogo or some shit like that, you know? Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. that's his real brother. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's just all like a brother. Yeah. But, but basically he responded to King, uh, uh, Chief Keefe and he was basically telling Chief Keefe like, all right, bitch, I got something for you coming Friday. I guess he gonna diss him back or something, but you know, I ain't really listened to the song all the way to see was it a diss. Mm -hmm. I heard, I heard the little bloggers posting it, the little parts that they felt like it was a diss or whatever. All right. But so when you seen that, do you feel like? You know, did you hear that song first of all? Yeah. Did you take it as a diss or it wasn't really like it was like they reaching the bloggers reaching when they. I just, it. bro. You know what I asked them, and I swear to God, bro, on deep thing when the motherfuckers sent it to me, I asked folks, I said, "Is this real?" Mm -hmm. Yeah, cause because on oh, Jay Money, bro, mm -hmm. like. After that shit, where Drake had that Tupac AI and then that Kendrick Lamar AI shit, bro, like, they had a song that was a response to Drake's song, bro, that it was a whole fake version. It wasn't Kendrick Lamar's ver It wasn't Kendrick Lamar's song. It was an AI response, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and when I seen that, bro, it just, you know... It it was tweaking me out, bro, because I felt like all this shit was happening at once, bro. Like, you had all these niggas beefing with each other at once. All these, you got Quavo, all of a sudden, him and, him and Chris Brown get into it simultaneously as Kendrick Lamar, J. Cole, Drake, and Metro, all of them having they one, Rick Ross, like, and I'm just looking, like, after that Kendrick Lamar shit came out, I literally said, like, a day before, I posted a, some shit, and I'm like, man, bro, I don't know what's real or what's fake. Like, all of a sudden, it's all this beef and these AI diss tracks getting made and shit. I don't know what's real or not. Mm -hmm. So now, I swear to God, this Sosa song just so happened to hit the streets 
at the same time, it's AI versions of shit being made, bro. Mm -hmm. And I know motherfuckers gonna listen and be like, no, bro, this really so so I could tell. I swear to God, if you'd have told me that AI, Kendrick Lamar song, it was no way on earth. You would have thought I would have thought that was Kendrick mm -hmm. Lamar. I would thought that was AI mm -hmm. fault until the nigga that made the song showed you how he made it. Mm -hmm. He got a video showing you how he made the AI folk. Damn, see, I didn't see that, see. Man, that go, he on TikTok deep. showed you the identity of him and everything and how he made it, bro. Mm -hmm. See, that's deep. So, it just threw me out, bro. I, I honestly, once I didn't, once I, because I really, like, I feel like the jury's still out on that song. Like, I don't know if it's AI or not. Mm -hmm. Like, I really don't. I, I can't even entertain it without knowing it's real because it just seemed like, why now? Mm -hmm. Like, when who got their hands on this song now? And this is old song supposed to happen in 2022. Mm -hmm. It's not new. And it ain't came out, of course, because folks don't want it out mm -hmm. if it's real. So, how I get out now? Yeah. yeah how saying. I get out? Why is all of us... just made up. Yeah, like, all of a sudden, this this guy... This, we got one of these songs? Mm -hmm. Like, oh, folks. Yeah. Like, I don't know, man. Like, 